Uh, how y'all doing? I want to welcome y'all to Strawberry Space, where we discuss transgender related topics. I mean, I, the sex party I just went to, I was just like, ooh, it, I, all I saw was generational trauma on a bed. Can I get some details on what happens here? So you, you arrive, where it's a nice, nice house in the hills, I'm assuming? Yeah, so a nice house in the hills, a lot of the celebrities have masks on, then it's a lot of agents and money men. Ooh, I'm Ugly. You had a sex party with your agent, huh? Yeah, exactly. I saw a few of my old agents like, yeah, I knew you were a little down low freak. Um, and then, like, they do a performance. All the performers are OnlyFans people. Mm -hmm. their, their company heads are usually there. All of the big ones are there. All their, their big girls are there. They all have sex with each other. Chicks with Dicks is very big in L.A. Everybody from rappers to LA. sports guys to everybody. Everybody wants a woman... A female face, female titties, and a dick fucking them. I've honestly gotten off to that point. Twitch their own. I've, I've gotten off to watching it. I thought I was watching the most beautiful woman get fucked, and I was, like, using my vibrator, and I was like, this is so hot. She was getting pounded up against a kitchen table. Mm -hmm. Perfect tits, most beautiful face I've ever seen. And then she turned around and had the most massive dick and just threw the guy down and just started fucking him. And I was like, damn. I don't have a dick, but that was... Bad old attrition there going on there, huh? I stopped for a second. I was like, should I be getting turned on by this? It's like when you watch your first rape porn and you're like, should I do this? And then, you, and then you feel disgusting after. Yeah. you never done it? No. Well, well, well. Miss Denity Kane herself, Aubrey O'Day. Child, she had a lot to say on trans women on her new... Um, interview that she had just did the other day so it's trans men and women how do you feel about that how do you feel that you know trans women's safe space is now become like bathhouses um sister and men and women i know that y'all mostly have this usually at every club you go to where there's like an eagle like if you see like in your city like the eagles and the onyx those are the places where you know it's shit that mostly goes down at but Hey, Strawberry Space, we're here discussing Aubrey O'Day today. Um, she had gave that little snippet on her interview because she's just now speaking out about making the band with the Diddy, but they were focusing primarily on OnlyFans and... Whew. she did playboy she did a lot of shit this is the perfect girl to speak out about this i told y'all when mary magdalene said something i didn't believe it but now when it comes from her mouth y'all will see we are occupying spacious and i am 100 percent against you know any slander i am for this like where do you want me to go y'all claim that trans women trick all these niggas and is this my safe space i'm not gonna be on a shirt over no dick like that's just not gonna happen the fuck we are here and we are in this place for such security that comes in it's a controlled environment it's discreet i am so for it and i'm just glad that it was like no recording no twitter or x or whatever you say and i'm proud of the girls for this you know you don't want us to escort you know i'm saying you don't want us to strip so now we have the privacy and we can have it in a, in a decent manner and just move right along our day and you know get your nut feel rejuvenated and just mosey on this is something that will prolong the girls you know for the longest time strawberry space the average lifespan of a trans woman was 35 so now we can move forward with this and i'm glad she spoke about this um sister women have been like a a safe space for a lot of trans women to go to just out of fear to escape the safety from men because you know a lot of men will hurt us no matter you know what color they are or you could be let me teach you some little lingo strawberry space that i just learned <laughs> See, you know, I thought we were called trans men and women, like transformers, or maybe like y'all trans and mutants and trans humans and trans vegetables. If you are a trans woman, like a trans man, and you're exclusively T for T, they will call you a vegetarian. Get it? Because trans vegetables, vegetarian, you're exclusively for your own kind. I was like, oh, that's a cute little thing, like to just say on the hype on the back end. So that way, you know, if you know, you know, you know, you use little 
little terms like caboodles and boots and I'm like oh yeah I'm gagging like I just caught your tea so um, you know this is a way we could stay safe I'm so happy she discussed and talked about this I know this had a lot of people gagging on Twitter I seen it via Instagram on Gay Magazine and I'm just happy that we have new alternatives for the longest times they would not allow like at like leather spots and bike clubs like it would be for men only so now I'm glad that they're opening their gates to include you know trans women so I just want to report on the strawberry space she ain't did nothing wrong I ain't gonna tear the girl up but um yes this is a monumental milestone in our community and LGBT and the fact that it heightened over to a cisgender like uh, space because she didn't go to no gay little spot y'all. she said this was a sex party at LA but you know how we hold do so yes girl so yes yeah, strawberry space I will be um dropping little exclusives here and there um you know you just look forward for my next videos I'm gonna be talking about Yolanda Saldivar I hope this video didn't um, offend anybody and I just wanted to be informative that you know now we can move forward and you know we can continue to be in seclusion because in the past a lot of times trans women were very um discreet like you rarely seen them out but now that we have so much more visibility we're is much more common so with that you know um comes greater responsibility for the people who you lay down with to keep you um sexually stimulated but you know safe as well so this has been strawberry space and thank you